difficult week? Yeah, it, it is a difficult week this week, absolutely. Obviously, you know, the disappointments of, of not winning the Challenge Cup on the weekend is very hard for the, the, everyone involved in the club. So, um, but you know, the, we've got to move on and, and kick back in a Super League mode. Is, that, is it difficult to lift the players after losing all like that, or is it just one of those where it's a different competition? We get back to the back for our Super League. Oh, I know it's definitely difficult. Um, you know, they're, they're extremely disappointed, and, and I can understand that. So. Um, but you know the, the good thing is we're, we're back into the uh, Betfred Super League and we've got three rounds to go and then we're in finals there so we haven't got time to feel sorry for ourselves we've got to get on with it. Is, that, is it a case of like managing the squad now in the run-up to the grand final or is it a case of just keeping on going and to keep that that league momentum going? Oh we've got a, a lot of players that um, need the games you know we've got um, Alex Wormsley, Rose, Morgan Knowles, um, Lachlan Coote. They've missed a lot of games of late, so um, we can you know use the next three rounds to get the match fitness up and, and get them ready for the finals. Exactly. Now we would look at a cast side who are struggling to qualify for the top five, uh, which is a very different cast side from the last two three seasons, isn't it? Mm. What have you made of them and on their struggles this year? Yeah, obviously you know they've had a lot of injuries early in the year, but you know the last few weeks they're playing really well and, and they're you know, throwing the ball around a fair bit back to sort of the Cass of old and got some very skillful players there so um, you know and as you said they're battling for for fifth spot there so it's going to be a, a tough game for us on Friday. Is that where do you see the main threats coming from this Cass? Oh as I said they're, they're skillful type players you know they've got the Matoudis playing really well um, Jake Truman's there they've got um, you know Ellis and Rankin and players like that so they, they've got some you know really skillful players there that we've got to make sure we're aware of and obviously McShane at nine's a great player. Is that what you talked about new beginnings this season there's some real battles going on the whole of the top five is alive to get into the playoff there's Salford, Cass, uh, seven eight teams that are involved in that and then you go to the bottom and there's two points separating mm. bottom from fifth from Leeds. Yep. I mean there's real battles and what have you, you made I mean sitting at the top of the tree for mm. so long it's always been looking down but what have you made of these battles and how intriguing has it been for you yeah well, I think it's well more intriguing now I think now that there's you know we've finished Challenge Cup and you know obviously 10 other sides have had a week off so now we're down to, to the last three games I think it's really going to obviously heat up as you said around the, the playoff spots as well as the, the dreaded um, relegation battle so I think it's going to be exciting for, for rugby league that's for sure. Is that, and how are you looking squad wise? Yeah, we're looking we're looking good. Um, yeah, we'll be okay, and and we'll just check in on them all tomorrow and see how they've pulled up. You know, extremely hot day down there on Saturday, and got through a lot of hard work. So see how the boys are tomorrow. Exactly. Like, no, they talk about this at Wembley uh, in football. It's a big pitch, isn't it? Yeah, it was. But look, it was a great game as well. You know, I think um, for the first sort of 25 minutes, we you know really played well and couldn't couldn't get a few calls and couldn't get a lead up and and then uh, Warrington just hung in there and you know deserved the win in the end. So, so at this point in the season, uh, do you, do you lot now now that you've secured your place and all of that, you know you're going to have a week off. Do you just sort of manage the squad now going through, or is it a case of momentum? Momentum or squad management, I mean, and yeah. it's a difficult position to be in, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So we need both. You know, for players that have played a lot, it's management. For as I said, but we've got you know five or six guys that have missed a fair few games, um, but we've been good enough to keep winning, which is great. So it's about getting them up to speed and match fit going into the final. So so we're ready to go then. I'd say it's difficult for you. I think everyone else would like to be in your position. Let's not forget that. that you you cut so much daylight at the top. Yeah, that's right. You know we. Yeah, deserve to be there through how consistent we've played this year. So, uh, but you know, we've got to perform well later in the year.